Hey guys, what is going on? It's Would You Rather Friday. I know that's your favorite time because it's one of my favorite times. So what's up, Mr. I Try Hard? What's up, Kelly? What's up, Kelly's channel? Friday, best day of the week. I'm so happy to be here. Once again, would you rather love it, love it, love it? Yes. And then again, tonight we have FNG Podcast. It's going to be a little later than usual. I'll put all the information in the description. I'll keep that updated in case anything changes so you guys know. So let's just get started with this. Would you rather have your genitals come to life and have their own voice or your rear end? <laughs> Um, oh my god, uh, I, I think I'm gonna have to go with the genitals on this one, cause I feel like we would be best buddies, right? I feel like, you know, him, like, my, my mini-me and, and myself, like, we could have, like, some epic conversations, we're both, like, huge perverts, would be like, yeah, let's go fuck this bitch, let's go, you know, he's basically, cause, okay, guys think with their dicks a lot of the time, right? So, I feel like if he could actually, you know, tell me what's up, you know, instead of just, you know, popping a boner whenever he wants to fuck, like, he'd be like, yo, yo, let's go fuck that bitch over there, fuck that bitch over there, let's have some fun. Whereas my ass would probably just give me shit. No pun intended. <laughs> so <was> so stupid. <laughs> hey, 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 don't, don't fucking shit on my joke. Again, no pun intended. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to go with my genitals on this one. I don't really care much for my balls, but, uh, me and my penis could have some really good conversations, just saying. Are there females at your work? Where you work? Uh, one. You're gonna get a fucking lawsuit because what's gonna happen is <laughs> your penis is gonna end up talking to her one time. And she's gonna like shoot up and be like, hey bitch, let me do you in the butt. And then you're screwed. I'm, I'm like punching myself in the grind, telling it to shut up. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> shut up, idiot! Oh, then she's gonna think you're like mentally disturbed yeah no if you like went to the grocery store it would just be like it would like just i just picture um someone with like a heart on you could see it through their jeans i just picture that and then mm -hmm. like a muffled voice coming from it <laughs> <laughs> like and it's just like ass tits ass butt <laughs> no no he would have he like he would have to control himself you know we'd have this like discussion where i'd like I, I i can't go outside i can't bring you to see hot chicks if you're not gonna shut the fuck up every now and again <laughs> yeah <laughs> you'd like to see a grandma he's like take them dentures out bitch <laughs> put your mouth on my dick and things will get so awkward yes because that's what i think when i see women all the time but it's your penis this is like it doesn't care <laughs> I know, that's the thing, like, yeah, okay, so, yeah, my penis thinks about pervy things all the time and can't fucking, yeah, okay, yeah, I'm still gonna go with my penis on this one, I, I think it's the great answer, I think we'd have a lot of fun together and have some epic stories to tell, but then, wait, masturbation would be really awkward. Oh, it would be <laughs> kind of gay, maybe. <laughs> you'd be like, you'd be like, yeah, yeah, go ahead, go faster, go faster. Oh, like, God, that would be so awkward. <laughs> What if your penis has a girl's voice? Uh, oh. Yeah, like a really sexy voice. I don't want to think of my penis as a lady, though. Yeah, that would be I want, I, I want my penis to be like a manly man, like, yeah! Where, you know, we're going at this bitch, instead of being like, yes, can you please touch me and have some lips on my... Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I just like, that was really weird. All right, so I, what am I going to choose? Shit. Oh, uh, I mean, what does a talking vagina sound like? It would, I think it would be kind of whiny and bitchy. So I'm not going to choose that. I'm definitely not going to choose a talking vagina. It's just asking for trouble. So I'll take the butt, and I have a feeling like a butt, if it had a voice, it would just be really sarcastic and silly and funny. I, I think that's the way to go here for me. Okay. What about, like, what about when you would fart? Like, would it be like, I'm gonna fart now, I'm gonna fart, it's, it's gonna be a good <laughs> oh one, my God, I'm gonna stink, like, I'm gonna st <gasps> Oh, God, no, in public, you know, like, sometimes you hold it in in public. Yeah. What if it's like, I'm holding in a fart! <laughs> and it, like, announces it to the whole world and they <laughs> think you said it. Again, like, like, the whole muffled, like, sound, like, uh, get to wash them now, get to wash them, hurry up, I gotta take a sh- I don't know, man. I, I, I think it would make for some really awkward situations. Well, it's somewhat a vagina, you know, if I had my I'm period, wet, it'd I'm be wet, like- I'm wet, I'm <laughs> wet. <laughs> no, but if I have my period, it's like, I'm bleeding! <laughs> <laughs> it 
Like, it would be screaming. It would be crying. It would be so bad. (laughs) Hurry up, stick something in me before I bleed everywhere. (laughs) Ah, man, I don't know. It's just... Wow. I I, I think both your answers would be a lose-lose situation (laughs) for you. If my boobs could talk, now that would be a different story. They would be chill. What? How would they like? How would they behave? I think they'd be crazy. They'd be funny. They would tell jokes. They'd be like, "Look at us! We're awesome." <laughs> You'd be like, "Hey, Kelly, this dude's looking at our tits. Let's make our nipples hard. See what happens." <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, no. Someone's just like looking at your boobs, and they're just like, "What are you? The fuck? Do you want us to whip a tit out? What the hell, man?" <laughs> they like just yell at people. No, they would be like the biggest flirts. They'd be like, oh, you're looking at my tits now? You like these, right? I know you like them. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> it would be so funny. <laughs> they like the biggest flirts. I think we have spent this entire Would You Rather talking about what different body parts would sound like if they It'd could be talk. Awesome. It, it would, would be, be really great. cool. I mean, I'm really thinking about this now. Like, if my nose could talk, it would be such a snobby bitch. I feel like it would have a really snooty nose. Really? Or, like, it's not snooty nose, like snooty voice, like a butler. Hmm. I don't know why, but that's what I picture in my head. This stinks. This stinks. Please get me out of here. This stinks. <laughs> I, I just feel like if it, you, you know that movie where like all the kitchen appliances come to life and they start talking? Beauty and the Beast? Y- thank you. Beauty and the Beast. I, I feel like if it would be that, but for our bodies and that would be great. I want all my body parts just to start talking. Yeah, everyone in the comment section below, why don't you give us your opinions on what certain body parts would sound like? I think that's really interesting. It is. What, which, okay, so, which body part would be the derpy, the derpy body part? The derpy body? Uh, my big toe. Yeah, that's what both, I was thinking. Yeah, both like, big toes hey would be just, yeah, <laughs> just totally retarded. Like, I'm here for nothing. Uh, yeah, what's up? Like, all the other toes are, like, super smart, and, like, I, I don't know. Like, I think the thumb would be the smartest one, because it's what we use to grab all the time, and yeah. it's really, like, a necessity for us humans. So I feel like if it would be, like, you know, talking down to all the other fingers, and, of course, the middle finger would be that one asshole who's like, flip me the bird! Flip, flip the bird! Let's go! Just flip, flip the bird! I don't know. <laughs> yes. I, just, I don't know why I'm, like, picturing it in that voice, but... <laughs> yeah, I just see my, like, big toe being like, I'm in a shoe. <laughs> and it thinks it's a joke, and everyone, like, the, the little toes are like, oh my god, did he just say that again? That's his only joke. They're like little valley girls. <laughs> what about your pinky? Do you think your pinky would be, like, just like a super emo finger? Because it does absolutely nothing except, you know, stick its pinky up every now and again in Europe when people drink tea? No, like, what else do you do with the, your pinky? The, like, I do love a good tea, so like it'll be really oh, it'll be Eng- like old English queen type. I see, I see. Like very posh. So, so your index finger would be like the smartest one, I think. Not, no, 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 no. That's the thumb. It would be the the. I I think it would be snobby as well because it's always being used and you're always using your pointing like your pointer finger. Yeah, I pointed at someone yesterday and I burst out laughing in the car. And Did they see you do it? No. It, it was a... I'm not going to talk about that because if I talked about it, you know, people would be like, you're mean, Kelly. And it wasn't... I wasn't trying to be a mean person, but mm-hmm. the, like what this person was doing kind of surprised me, so I just burst out laughing and pointed at them. So here's here's my deal with laughing at other people. If they don't see you do it and it's not one, one of your good friends, it's just like some random that you meet out in like... I don't know, life or whatever, I, th- I think it's okay. But if they see you and, like, they see it as, and, like, you're degrading them, then that, that's that's offensive. But as long as nobody sees it, I think it's okay. Yeah, that's that's how I see it, too. But I don't know, whatever. So we better get to another Would You Rather. <laughs> like, yeah, we, we really should. spent we a should. lot of time on that. It was a good question. You know, yes. I didn't expect it to be that good, but it, if you think about it, it's kind of fun. All mm-hmm. right. So would you rather be constantly picking your nose and eating your boogers in public or picking your ears and eating the earwax. Uh, gonna go. Is this for like a lifetime? For a lifetime. Oh my god! See, picking your nose is generally seen by everybody as you know being like terrible and like you're disgusting and all that stuff. Nobody really 
I've never really seen somebody pick his ears and eat it. Yeah. Um, I got a feeling, though, like, picking your nose would be less nasty than picking your ears. Like, it's wax. You're fucking eating ear wax. Like, think about it. I've accidentally, I like, I, before I've, like, um, I don't know if you've ever done it. You, like, itch your ear. Like, you get uh-huh. really in there. And then you accidentally, like, end up, like, I don't know, licking your finger later on. Yep. And it's, like, very, like... It's it's disgusting. Yeah, it tastes it's bad. Like, like, it's sour. It's, like, strong. <clears throat> yeah, it's really strong. And people are like, oh, my God, Try Hard picks his ears and eats it all the time. No, I do. Should... Yeah, bros. <laughs> That's why this question, I chose it because I was so excited. No, I'm joking. No, yeah. I, I've, teased, I've tasted ear, earwax before, and I'll go with boogers. Uh, man, I don't know if I'd like... I, like, I see what a booger looks like, and I feel like... I don't like the texture. I want to go with earwax. I don't know why. Wow. I just, uh, and I feel like people judge me more about the boogers. I think they would. I, th- I think if you were, like, constantly picking your ears, it'd be like, what the fuck, this, per- this bitch is crazy. But if you're picking your nose, you're, you're, you're disgusting and crazy. Yeah, I mean, ugh. no, I don't want that. <laughs> so, no. All right, and a really quick would you rather... Would you rather have sex with someone the opposite sex that is covered in hair from the waist up or the waist down? I feel this one's way easier for you. Waist down. Yeah. Fuck it. I don't... Oh, wait. That's not what I expected. (laughs) Really? I thought you were going to say waist up and then just turn her over and do her in the butt. No, because I feel like if it's waist up, her hair, like her her head, she, she, she looks like a fucking monkey with like a nice vagina. And we've discussed this before. Vaginas aren't pretty pretty to begin with. Oh, so you so, want to cover it up? I don't give a fuck. As long as I can get in there, I'm not like a big leg man. Like it's not gonna affect me it's all gonna that much. It's gonna be nice much. and furry for you down there, maybe. Maybe I'll feel good. Maybe. More I mean, maybe I'll like the hair. I don't even know. Um, <laughs> but I, I I still want to see a beautiful face in extreme pain when I'm fucking him with my 12 inch dong. Fucking him. Whoa! Did I say you said them. him. I said them, Kelly. Oh I said my them. God! No, you them. said him. He said him. We're gonna find <laughs> out. He do- You totally said him. You're making this shit up. I said them. And now watch everybody rewind and try to see. Oh, what they're the fuck gonna I be said. like, he said him. <laughs> I guess we'll find <laughs> out. <laughs> I, I I just forget what I said, anyways. So. All right, I'm gonna choose. Um, God, I hate hair. I'll choose the waist up so that when we do it, I'll just, like, I don't know. I guess if it's not going to be furry hair. It's going to be, like, man hair. All right, it's going to be waist down, then. If it was, like, nice furry and cute hair, I'd be, like, rubbing my face in it. But since it's not, I'll go waist <laughs> down because I don't want to <laughs> see it You're not going to fucking face. braid it. It's, like, it's basically, like, pubic hair all over you. Yeah, I don't want that. <laughs> oh, God. No, thank you. So from the waist down? Yeah, the waist down. There we go. go. All right, guys. That is it for Would You Rather this week. Leave us some Would You Rather questions in the comment section or send them in a message. It really helps us out. You guys always... Those are all from my subs, and they were really interesting. I liked those questions. They got some good questions. Yeah, yeah, definitely. So, yeah, check out Mr. I Try Hard's channel. Check us out on FNG Podcast tonight, and have a great day, guys.